I'm Tracy Frizey. I'm the medical interventions teacher at Melville High School. This particular unit that we're working on is our cancer unit. One of our patients was diagnosed with osteosarcoma. What the student's task is, is to build a usable prosthetic. Basically the instructions were here's some materials make an arm. So we kind of had to use prior knowledge that we knew about the arm, um, the wrist, the hand. We are using my students knowledge of the anatomy of the arm with the digital electronics students knowledge of simple machines. My students are here as consultants, as the engineering consultant side to say yes you can do that or no that you can't do that. We took the initiative of taking all the ideas that the biology students or the MI students have and basically putting all their ideas on paper, giving them suggestions. They had the general ideas of like the mechanics and everything of it and we knew more about the anatomy and stuff about the arm and that in collaboration kind of came up with our final product. A lot of the first day stuff was the collaboration piece. This was the first time they were actually together in the same room. So they were doing a lot of brainstorming on that first day trying to figure out what pieces work together. People came up with like the the hinge portion and like the arm and how to kind of harness it on the person. So we just kind of collaborated as a unit. It's the biomed students that are bringing in the ideas of, no, 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 we have to be able to have that, that arm to where it has swing to it. Because, you know, the human joint and the muscle tissue or the muscles in the design allow the arm to move. Um, it was really fun to see what uh, different, different things that we had in mind for it, like what, what different uh, choices people made, like how they bend the arm and how they make it move around and pick up the cup. Like a whole lot of different hand designs and I had a lot of fun doing it. So this kind of is a lot more fun for my students who are not used to the engineering side of science. <laughs> what? <laughs> what did you get a you gotta put it down. Put it down. Put it down. Can you go quick? Can you go quick? What they're going to go away with or take away from this whole project is A, first of all, is the collaborative point. You know, what have I brought away from this? What have I learned from someone else? But B, the idea if they do something like this farther down the road of, oh, okay, now I have eight ideas in my head, not just one. And these are the kinds of careers that these kids want to get into. And especially when you think about STEM, science, technology, engineering, and math, this is, you know, right in their wheelhouse.